moments ago, a Category 4 tornado ripped through Otana and has destroyed a newly built cabin. As you can see, the footings there, the house has been picked up and dry and thrown all the way over to it is um Enver. It's ended up in Enver, as you can see there, the roof's been torn off. This is tragedy for for Roach Goslov and his and his ranger co-worker who were occupying the building. There's Roach's partner. The Roach actually flew with the building. They are getting emergency services in to to help these poor souls out. Roach Goslov and his co-worker Maslin Gasrave have been absolutely thrown about by a tornado, category four it was, through Otana. There's a recently destroyed house there that, that had suffered the same fate. It was desecrated in a savage attack. It was a savage desecration of a, of a bungalow in Otana. Now they've got a Category 4 tornado that's just ripped through. The house has been thrown down to Enver. We have the reports are coming through. The emergency services are on their way. Yeah, we're just going across to CNN now to view the severity chart here. I'll just put it all up for you. I am smiling. But I am smiling now, but it just so you know what you're looking at, I am going to put the chart up, thanks to CNN we've just crossed to. As you can see, it's an EF4, a Category 4, devastating tornado that has ripped through Otona and thrown a cabin kilometres down to Enver, to the border of Enver and Buell, and um, Roach Goslov has been thrown with the building. He is outside of the building now, the cabin. But he did go with it, and um, Maslin, his partner, is left behind. But um, the emergency services are coming to them. This is live here, exclusive from the Nantina region. Otana in the Nantina region has just undergone a Category 4 tornado ripping through the whole district and throwing the cabin all the way to Enver with Roach Guslove on board. So... I am smiling. Here with the chopper, and we are just reporting on Otona that it's just undergone a Category 4 tornado that's ripped through the entire district. This is live shots from the chopper. We cannot see the house due to the um, vegetation there but you can see right there we'll zoom right in on the ground zero there the the footings of the cabin that was just thrown kilometers down to Enver and Roach Goslov was in the house when he got dragged all the way to the Enver and Buell border and has and he's now awaiting emergency services to arrive the ambulance are on their way. The police are too slow to respond. They don't know what they can offer in terms of getting some facilitation of some remedy to, to the calamity that they find themselves in. They're, they're, it's basically that they're homeless now. That's the calamity. They've got nothing left. It's just been torn from the base from the footings in the concrete it's just been it's like it's been sliced at the base and Maslin his partner is um avoided she was she was tied down to a section of pole that was concreted into the ground she managed to tie herself down to the pole that goes for kilometers down into the ground and and the harness stopped her from being dragged down to Enver with the building. But somehow Roach Guslov was showing signs of life. 
We are in fear for his life at the moment. He is awaiting emergency services to arrive on the scene to facilitate some sort of remedy to the situation Roach has found himself in. He is conscious, but he's, he may not be aware of what's happened. We'll just zoom out now. This is live from o, on, over at Otona, the Nandina region. They've, o, Envar has just gone through a severe earthquake. Now a tornado has hit, and it is quite a bright day. The storm came, and then the sun shone right on them afterward. This is the aftermath of the tornado. The winds have dropped, and the sun is peeking out now and really showing them that who's really in control here. Yeah, we're down here at Otana, um, in the Nandina region. We are live. And um, as you can see, the ambulance have just arrived to Roach Gosloff, who was thrown in the house that's behind us, all the way to the Envar and Buell border. They are administering care for him at the moment. They have got to him, Roach Gozlov. He is conscious, and but he is not sure of what's occurred. The Red Cross have arrived. The administration of Red Cross have arrived to, to witness and facilitate some immediate funds and fundraising for the Otana region for this devastating tornado category 4 that's ripped through Yeah we're live here from the scene at the house the cabin in question in Otana and um, as you can see there Ian from the Temple of Heaven has turned up to speak to Maslin. She's been offered a wheelchair from authorities. There's the wheelchair for Maslin. So she is undergoing there. They are un un untying her from the poles at the moment. And um, she was tied down to the poles. And she did that before the tornado ripped through and um, it has saved her life. Kyoon is offering some support. Um, obviously, prayers are with Roach Goslov at the moment. So Kyoon there, the man from the Temple of Heaven, here to supervise the saving. And there's the scene. Roach Goslov has been transported back, back to his to his house here. They have transported him from Enver, Border and Buell back into Otona. The ambulance are administering some care to him now. Maslin has been put in a wheelchair. She's undergoing her care now and Kyoon is supervising here. The man from the Temple of Heaven with his trademark blue globe that he wears above his head on a tilt. And Red Cross are in the background discussing what they can do for immediate action of funds injection into Otona region to get this civilization cabin back on its base. They will call the crane in. Um, the builders are on their way down to the scene. This is terrible news, tornado category four here in Otona. We are coming live to you. It's, it's mid morning here. Terrible day today. Yeah, we are coming live to you from Otona um, in the Nandina region and um, here we can see the ambulance have been sent on their way. Roach Gosloff has rejected their care and hospitalisation. He has rejected their care. They did transport him from Enver back to the Otana site there where the tornado ripped through with devastating effects, category four. So the ambulance have been sent on their way, heading back to their facility. There they are, they were the immediate arrival, arrive on the scene to assist Roach there. So they are heading back now, the ambulance. They've been rejected and the Red Cross have funded some immediate funds 
to get Rhodes Guzlov some relief from what he's just gone through. some tobacco. Roach needs some tobacco. Good evening. I'm Sandy Lewitchin. Reports are that the Category 4 tornado has been investigated by detectives. The police finally turned up and they are doing detections on spatial movement. The Category 4 cyclone was deemed to be a drop piece of air from air coming in and out of some a singer's mouth. Allegations have been made that the band is named Portal, the album is named Blood Red Tape, the singer is unknown, the vocals, are, the creator of the vocals are unknown, there is no name to match the, the creation. So we don't know this man or where he's from or what he's capable of. They can be looked up on the internet. Their information is out there for detectives to undergo their assessments independently and make a decision of their own with using their own mind. This is exclusive news coming from Otona, Nandina Region, local news. I'm Sandy Louie-Tune, reporting. Roach Goslov received a phone call from James Hempfield in the Envar region with his wife Chloe Madison and have taken Maslin, his partner, to look after her while Roach Goslov awaits the crane lift and house back on its base. She waves goodbye at 11 o'clock. MJK said, Jimmy. Hempfield has been probably listening to Jimmy on Enema, they are saying, and decided that it was time to call. So Maslin waved goodbye at 11 o'clock, thanks to a phone call from James Hempfield to offer support in the Envar region for the Otona Tragedy Tornado Category 4 storm that hit today. All thanks to Jimmy Hempfield. Here we are, in Otona. This was recorded earlier today. Red Goslov awaits the crane lift with Ty Unit from the Temple of Heaven. Red Cross Administration are there to supervise the lift. Here we go now. This was the lift earlier today. As you can see, the, the house was covered up with protective bag, bags. And it was crane lift. It, it was getting lifted up and out of Otana off the border in the crane manoeuvred itself around, dropping the house on its base, ready for the rebuild. Workers are readying themselves for the rebuild. There's the crane lift and the Red Cross workers awaiting the drop now, the, the descent of the crane. So it was lifted safely off the ground, and then it was transported and placed back on the base, as you see there, with the onlookers of Kaiyu from the Temple of Heaven and Roach Goslov. I'm Stewie Ramchart, reporting for Nandina Local News. Yeah, thanks Stewie. It's great to see that they've quick resolution to the problem here in Otona, in the Nandina region. So thanks for your work there Stewie. Back to the studio now. Thank <laughs> you. 
tragedy today, 29th of February 2024 for the Otana district in the Nandina region. Thanks to our reporters Stewie Ramchart and Stan Mandhavai on the scene reporting. I'm Sandy Lewichoon, Nandina Local News.